EPA and all that. They, they have art projects going right now where you can um, see how innovative, like, uh, to get the switch to go in. I made it this so you could oh, see I how, see. like, because it's a, so it, now one thing when you make these, they have an automatic, most every cassette has automatic cutoff because mm -hmm. it senses the tape's going too slow or it's not right. Mm -hmm. It doesn't want to eat the tape so it cuts it off. Uh -huh. So you have to defeat that. You have to figure out a way to how, how either, do you defeat that? well, it depends on the machine. Some of them you have to put a fake circuit that keeps pretending that it's on, like a little oh, really? magnet. Uh -huh. And some of them you just have to keep the button pushed down. Oh, and that's what this is for? See, that, oh, that I keeps see. it, I see, see. that position is down. That's off. You see how that's oh, just a cam? I, now I see it, yeah, like a camshaft. Yeah. And you have golf tees here. See? Oh, yeah, <laughs> sure. That makes the... Without the golf tee, it wouldn't... Uh... <laughs> now, there's lots of neat things. Like, if you have a power supply that's uh, extremely bad, it's pretty neat because the motor keeps sucking, sucking, slowing oh, up and mm -hmm. stuff. And then you can get a, a, a NICAD battery charger, which is... It puts out such a small amount of current that your motor is always recovering from the drag. Uh -huh. Or you can get a real high powered supply which will always keep the motor running real good and stuff. So all kinds of real high tech. It works every every time so there's something not like that. I think to that extra little motor. This is the weirdest thing. Oh, okay. You not There's plug another plug, in. I guess. Yeah, there you go. But it doesn't make... Yeah, because that one's not plugged doesn't in. It doesn't make any sense. You don't have the, 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 the um, tape deck plugged in. Okay, technical data here. <laughs> plug in first, and then turn on. Yeah. And then it's very hard first. Is it power on? There you go. So that thing's cool. Yeah. Really, see, it's just slow speed. The ones I really love are variable speed, which is super duper when they go whew, whew, different. That's the yeah. one I wanted to play, but this is the only one I had right up in front that you can find. You know. Here's something for you, you know, and they give me the stuff that's blown. They and I went it. in and just put two fuses in it and keep them all this uh, pretty cool. I've got a, a Sansui that uses fuses. No. They, they have fires, multiple fires in all the Radio Shack warehouses. I mean, every time you go in there, they say, we don't have parts for that, we had a fire. <laughs> and like, this happens three to four times. That's their way of getting around the, having to fix stuff in Radio yeah. Shack. This woofer was found. I don't know if it comes off, but it's really cool woofer. It's got big, I don't even think the tweeter works. We're not going to need a tweeter for what yeah. we're doing today. This is one of those huge That's the one that I got. Wow, that's really neat. Man, I, I told you already, but it was a weird. Um, I need a speaker wire. Is all I need. It was the weirdest thing at auction because see, that girl, that was my she high gave, school. She gave you the. Um, she was the high school cheerleader. Yeah. A bit, and about a year older than I was, and we never even talked to each other because she was like, I was a little geek and she was like the big, you know, cheerleader yeah. queen thing. You're above it. Somebody's all. burning. The fire going yeah. on somewhere. Huh. Cut this little yeah. wire out. They can pull those all over. Yeah, well, bit, not the way I. Yeah. Let me see about a wire cutter. Here's one. Uh, yeah. Also, let's see, yeah, you can hook it up yeah, in the back of the receiver if you want to. Yeah. Or whatever. Yes. Columbia presents. <laughs> I mean, you know, Americans have always been behind this, and now it's approved. Wow. Really? That's really amazing. Choir of the Red Army USSR, set C. That's really <laughs>
most new decks don't have a board. I mean, really, most of you go in, they don't have a tape. You actually have to jam paper up because it has to push the record. Wow. <laughs> they have a, they're cut off at the end totally. They don't have any wind, they don't have any covering over the head, so they real open sound. Did the cats leave? Oh, oh they're uh, oh, sleeping. Man. Crazy. No, I'm not mean to. No. This isn't like being old. <laughs> You're being recorded, kid. Good, good. Okay. <laughs> good. See, the numbers, I think, aren't working. Yeah, they may yeah, work. Yeah, they're, they're coming through. Yeah, we should oh, record it on normal speed, speed. Uh, see? Uh, that's the deal. That sounds neat. Yeah, this should be great. Oh, that's all the way. Oh, I got a friend, he's got a, um, a parrot. Mm -hmm. And I was at his house and he yells at the parrot, shut up, you know. And all this. So then all of a sudden this dog barks, like really mean ass. The parrot thinks it's a dog. He says, the parrot has an identity crisis and all this stuff. And that parrot was just barking and barking and barking like a dog. <laughs> and I told him I want to record it. That sounds like a person to me. Doesn't it? Let me find a tape that's pre-recorded. Okay. So maybe we have something. See? Right. You don't get in there.